So we have four brand new new cars in Vehicle Legends, guys. And we're gonna go ahead and check them all out. Let's get this video started. Whoa, guys, that was amazing. But what's more amazing, guys, is that we finally hit 250,000 subscribers. Now, I have a new challenge for you. Our brand new goal is 500,000 subscribers. So before this video gets started, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to click that post notification bell for more videos and live streams. Now I gotta go guys, I'm late for my race, I'll see you in the video! What is going on guys, it is your boy T, Stinger, and today guys we are here in Vehicle Legends because we got 4 brand new vehicles plus a limited guys and today we're gonna be checking them all out because we wanna see if we should even buy this brand new limited vehicle guys because I feel like it's not gonna be worth it. But the good thing is we can test drive all this vehicles. Whoa, how did he get that wrap? That's cool, the green $100 bill wrap with the green rims on the Aston Martin. That's sick, my boy, that is so cool. Oh, we got one of the newest cars right over here, guys, the Porsche GT4 RS. And then we got the, I'm guessing this is the Lycan Hypersport or the Funier Hypersport. I'm not sure which one this is, but we'll go ahead and check it out right now in this store. And uh, my boy, I am baroque in here. I don't have anything to buy it with. But let's check out the very new cars, guys. We got the GTR right over here, which is the limited vehicle in six days, guys. It's for 215 thousand dollars look at this gtr model it looks very very nice almost as realistic as driving empires and it's getting really really good it's scary good and then we also got the porsche gt4 rs model and you guys can see this is so cool the interior is so beautiful and it's almost spot on if not very spot on and you guys can see this massive spoiler in the back which is really really nice and the aero kit that comes with it. And then we got the, I'm guessing this is the Lycan Hypersport. I'm not sure, the Fenir and the Lycan Hypersport, they look very similar to me, but this is so sick. I love the way this looks. This is most likely the Fenir Hypersport right, uh, right here, guys, but it looks so mean. It kind of looks like a alligator to me for some reason. <laughs> and then last but not least, we got the Bugatti Mistral in here, and wow look at the details on this i love the fact that they still uh spelled poid right over here or the brand name on the back where instead it says uh bullied or bugatti they have poid back here which is so cool and you guys can see the interior it is absolutely spot on this actually makes me happy the fact that this is actually super spot on. I'm gonna start liking this game, guys. I'm really starting to like this game. The fact that their models are very, very nice and they're almost becoming super realistic. But let's go ahead and test drive this Porsche. I wanna test drive this Porsche right here. And we got five minutes to do it. And you guys can see that we can open the doors. Can we even open the hood? We can't, but you guys see we got the headlights right here. That's kind of barely showing, which is kind of unfortunate. I really wish the lights would turn on. And you guys can see that we have the porsche and i believe this one drifts really nicely too this thing sounds very very nice i thought it would have an active spoiler on it i'm not sure if the real porsche does but it does look like this has an active spoiler on it but it might just be fixed but i do want to try racing it around the map you know what let's go my boy i'm gonna go against this corvette right here let's see if this can compete here we go let's go i do want to see the top speed of this car right here because i'm very curious so far we're going to about 160 170 and we're about to hit 200 which is so oh we got 200 let's go and we're going super fast right now guys here we go look at that 230 yes oh my goodness 230 and then the brakes couldn't even handle it guys this is insane but can it drift though oh it can do a drift but i feel like we need to mod this for it to drift like very well but you guys can see in first person view we are absolutely oh 
spinning out of control but every single time we use the boost i like this effect of us like shaking in the car which is almost realistic in a way guys which is super cool and the bumps in the road just makes it so much better look at this this is cool i love the, this car's mechanics wait oh i was about to say did we just flip over but we got a first place with 77 seconds on the clock. That's nice. Ooh, look at the Hyper Sport right there. That is nice. Look at the way it opens up. I wish our hood would open on the car, but it doesn't. I think if you were to mod this car, I think it would be super, super OP. But we don't have the money right now to even buy one of these cars. So you know what? We're going to save it and hopefully we get something going. But here we go. We are on the highway race with the Porsche now. I kind of just want to see the top speed of this. I know that we're just going in a straight line, but I really want to see what the potential of this car is. I believe it can go 300. I just feel like we haven't hit it yet. But here we go. We're going 228, 230. Oh, I don't think it can hit 300, guys. I think maybe if it's, like, modded, it can. But I'm shaking way too much. Look at this. This is crazy. <gasps> we barely won. Look at this. 34 seconds to 33 that's insane all right now let's go ahead and test this hyper sport right here i love the doors guys look at that that is cool but i cannot see anything out of this car this is insane and look at the interior very very accurate almost like the real thing and i love the fact that we can open the the back and then the front hood look at that we have exploded my boys this is so cool all right let's see the speed on this bad boy oh it could drift it could drift guys it can drift really really nice it has an active spoiler too you know what let's go ahead and test this on the highway race because i kind of want to see if it's any faster than the porsche which it should be but we just have to check all right here we go highway race against other hyper cars right now this is insane i mean we could still see pretty good in here i mean we could still see the road pretty straight I, I i can't complain about that there are some other games where you can't even see the road at all oh my gosh you guys see the power on this we're already hitting 300 miles per hour oh my gosh yo that is wild that is crazy and we just lost because of that little mistake but you know what i want to run that again i want to run that again guys i think we can win in no time all right here we go here we go the back of this kind of looks like a very very chunky mclaren 720s i don't know why oh gosh oh and you guys can see how we can run out of control super easily if we hit a little bump on the road gosh but it's going up to 330 miles per hour which is insane what look at that 30 seconds flat guys that's cool you can also put up the spoiler too Ooh, look at the spoiler that's so nice this is worth it i like i like this car this is pretty worth it guys in my opinion oh this seems like a fair race right here bugatti and a pagani all right I am ready to take my boys to Gapplebee's. Here we go, guys. We're going 320. Let's go. <laughs> we finished in 28.58 seconds, guys. That's like almost two seconds faster than what we did the first time. I have to buy this car. Look at the boost on it. When we activate the boost, there's like four nitrous exhausts in the back. That is sick. And if we exit our vehicle, check this out. Boom. Boom, look at that flex, my boy. <laughs> that is straight flex right there. All right, now we got the GTR. This is the car that is going to be limited. Now, I don't see why, but we're going to test it out. It looks very, very nice. And you guys can see that we can open the doors. Ooh, look at the blue interior on this car. It is so nice. Carbon wheel with this exact GTR interior. That is wild. <laughs> that is actually really, really crazy. Let's go ahead and close the doors right here. And let's go ahead and test it out on the race. It's pretty quiet, but the handling is great. Oh, that boost just kicks in. Look at that. That is crazy. All right, let's go. I think I'm ready to take this to the highway race, guys. All right, here we go. Go. Oh, the GTR never fails us when it comes to, like, speed taken off. But I do have to say that the interior is nice and the visibility is perfect i gotta say the visibility on this car is almost perfect and you can see oh my gosh we're going 240 miles per hour on this bumpy road let's help ourselves out on this hill 
and I want to go ahead and charge up on my boost so I can see how fast we can go in this straight. And look at that, 234 miles per hour. I wish we could have done a little bit better on the top speed, but I feel like the, the road's just way too bumpy. I mean, the cars almost look realistic, but number one, the lights doesn't have any glow to them. And number two, the roads are way too bumpy to be racing in. It does sound very, very nice. I think the biggest like reason why this car is going to be limited is the fact that you can actually get this modified so much to the point that I believe it can hit almost 400 miles per hour. So we're not going to take the risk and not buy it. So I probably will be buying this car right here just because I feel like this is going to be the most heavily modded vehicle in the game and if you guys want to see that let me know in the comments down below all right last but not least guys we got the poid right here or the bleed i love those lights you guys just saw them glow right here and you guys can see the detail the absolute crazy detail of this car they even got the alcantara correct on the seats and then on the dash and then you guys can see that the visibility is not bad at all just because we have this roof cut off and i feel like i can just like look over the top if i really wanted to but let's test this out this is a bugatti mistral right here Ooh, and that spoiler looks so mean too i love the way that looks let's just keep it up right here look at that now let's check out the top speed i want to see the top speed of this mistral and i love the lights the lights actually glow on this one which is cool and then we got a gtr right here oh my gosh hopefully he is not fully modified my boy or else i will poop my pants here we go four to three two one go here we go taking off correctly oh my gosh yo we are already hitting 200 miles per hour we're not even 20 30 percent in the race let's go oh 321 oh oh gosh it's not oh no <laughs> bruh bruh i can't believe we actually hit the water can we still catch up i think that would be like the most og win ever is if we catch up but i don't think we can well let's go ahead and test it out look at that 38 seconds bruh <laughs> he beat me he said ggs all right it, it's whatever my boy i mean I, I did fall off a bridge but gg all right this time no more falling off bridges oh gosh <laughs> we almost crashed again what is that guy driving yo he's going way too fast right now oh gosh here we go let's see if we can catch up to him and he's go he's fall probably fully modified and boom look at that 27.34 that's so much better than what we did last time what that is cool i love this one right here i'm gonna race it again oh why did you just open up my hood my boy can we open up the back of the car oh, i don't think we can i don't think we can open up the engine bay here we go we're taking off now let's go ahead and keep boosting oh i think he's racing with me with a rimac or a sec to a tara i can't see any of that but he is flying look at that he looks like he's not even in a car anymore bro that is crazy but we can only go up to 322 miles per hour i mean i don't say only but but that is actually very very fast unmodded guys but that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this if you guys want to see the gtr in another video as well guys let me know fully modded and i'm gonna miss this mistral guys this is a beautiful car in the game super detailed and i wish we can buy it but we are a baroque bro but you know what let's drive this back to the dealership and let's go ahead and buy that gtr before it's too late i feel like i'm gonna forget i feel like i'm just gonna miss out on it so let's go ahead and buy it right now might as well buy one car if we're gonna test drive it but give it to me and mm, white or yellow or orange you know what i like the red let's do red it's a little bit different purchase boom we got it and now we are more broke i don't know if that was a smart move but hopefully it is thank you guys so much for watching hope to see you guys in the next video peace out